Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, Rosie Cooks. I'm going to make a small lemon cake. Okay, this is six cups. This is 12 cups. I'm making six cups. This is perfect for when you have just a small group of people. And it's equivalent to like a loaf. You can put this in a loaf pan, like a nine by five loaf pan. Look how gorgeous this is, the design. It's gonna be so pretty. Okay, this is what we're gonna make. So first of all, I have another bowl, and right here, I zested one lemon and I juiced it. Okay, so this is the juice of one lemon. I zested this lemon and I cut the zest in half. So I'm gonna use half of it for inside my cake. This is three eggs. and one can of sweetened condensed milk. And then I'm going to mix all this together. Okay, this is all mixed together. So now I'm going to add one and a quarter cups of self-rising flour. Now what is self-rising flour? It's all-purpose flour, but it already has baking powder, and a little bit of salt. It's already, you can buy it like this. If you don't wanna go out and buy self-rising flour, I'll have some measurements on how to make it in the description box. Okay, so now I'm gonna mix all this together. Okay, it's all mixed together. Okay, so now here's my dish my bunt pan, and I sprayed it with a nonstick baking spray. This is the one that has flour. Okay, so now I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add my batter to my dish, to my bunt pan. So here's my bunt pan, and the batter is inside. I have a 350 degree oven waiting, nice and hot. And this is supposed to cook anywhere from 35 to 45 minutes. I will let you know. Okay, you guys, look at this perfect little bunt cake. Oh, it's beautiful. It's been 45 minutes and it's perfect. Came out clean with a toothpick. And uh, yeah, it's perfectly done. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna wait 10 minutes and then I'm gonna flip it on to a dish. Look at this, you guys. <laughs> this is so nice. That, that bun pan, is it just makes a perfect, very fancy little cake. So now I'm gonna wait for it to cool off and I'm gonna make an icing for it. And that's where I'm gonna use the second half of my little lemon zest. So I'm gonna let this cool off. And uh, just to let you know, I will leave a link in the description box on where to buy that uh, bunt pan on Amazon. So now I'm gonna make a glaze. This is one cup of powdered sugar and one tablespoon of lemon juice. So now you're gonna, you're gonna mix this and you're gonna see the consistency because it can be different every time. So I'm gonna put this in until I totally see, and I, I'm probably gonna need a, a little bit more liquid, but I'm gonna use milk. And lemon and milk, that makes kind of like a buttermilk. So now I'm gonna go with one teaspoon of milk, and then I'm gonna stir it a little bit more and I might need another teaspoon of milk. And that's the way you're gonna do it until you see the consistency. See how it all just kind of comes together? Hmm, I kind of like this. It's not too bad, not too bad. I like it kind of thick, but runny a little bit. Okay, so let me get my cake. Okay, so here's my cake. And I'm just gonna carefully try to put some in in these folds right there. 
it's thick enough just so that it kind of looks nice nice look at that this is a real lemony cake if you like that this is a good cake for you see it's thick enough to where I can work with it it's okay if it gets other places Here we go there we go look at that Okay, so last but not least, I'm adding the rest of those, that uh, lemon zest, just to make it pretty. This is a beautiful little cake. Look at this. And it's the perfect size for a small crowd. <laughs> okay, you guys, so now I'm going to add a little bit of powdered sugar, just to kind of take it over the top. Look at that. Very nice. Look at that. <laughs> Amazing. And so easy. Beautiful. So this is my small bunt pan, six cup lemon cake. And it's beautiful. Look at that. Okay, so... Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give me a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Please subscribe, and I will see you next time.